Hi, I'm Rachel Andrews and this is Everyday Athlete. Welcome along. Uh, first of all, I'd like to say a big hello to the new subscribers this week. Great to have some more of you along and hopefully you enjoy this week's video. And this week's video is about biosecurity. So I'm on holiday in Wales this week in the Brecon Beacons and something that's really important to me is making sure that I don't spread any of the non-native invasive species around. So I brought plenty of swimmers with me and we'll take a little look at that through the video. I'm uh, having a holiday where I'll be dipping in quite a few different places and different waterways. So I wanted to make sure that I'm not responsible for taking any non-native invasive species from one to the other. So what I have to do every time I get out is check the costume to make sure that there's no weed or anything on it and uh, to remove that and leave that out the waterway. Clean it in uh, clean water, uh, in fresh water, and then thoroughly dry it before I use it again, which is why I've brought a little collection. Nothing like the number that uh, Kimmy Joe's got, that's something I aspire to in the future, um, but uh, nonetheless, a number of costumes to be dipping in and out of the lakes and rivers and little waterfalls in this area. Can't wait. Well, that completes my first dip in Wales for this little trip, and what a dip it was. It's only really short, you can still see the bridge just over my shoulder there. So it's only a couple of hundred metres, but in that couple of hundred metres, I saw not one, but two kingfishers, amazing. And uh, one of them buzzed right past me along the waterfront uh, and up into a tree. And I was like, oh, was that a kingfisher? And then it dropped down just as I went past and skimmed right in front of me and into the side. And I went right past it as it sat on a rock. I haven't seen one that close ever. Um, and it just sat there and kind of waited for me to go past. That was amazing. So anyway, I finished my first dip. What I need to do now is uh, wash that costume off, fully dry it to make sure I'm not taking anything from this waterway, the River Usk, into a lake or a different river or anywhere else. Can't wait for the next one. Dip number two is a waterfall. Check out the view behind me. Well, there's a different kind of dip for me this morning. Um, I'm just hopping in here in the Usk at Brecon to go for a training swim. Uh, I'm training for the Dart 10K, so today I'm hoping to do about a 4K, uh, 4K swim. Uh, the beauty of it is, completely flat. I usually train in the sea, so this is amazing. And I've already seen, there's a whole bunch of tiny little um, fish swimming around. I don't know if that's gonna be super exciting for me, whether I'm going to freak myself out a little bit. What a lovely swim. It was so clear in there. Uh, so clear in fact, I managed to find a few little treasures. Let's take a look. I do love it when I can go swooping around and find a bit of treasure, especially when it is a bunch of golf balls. How cool is that? So clear, could spot them as I swam down the side of the golf course. Bloody brilliant. Pity it wasn't gold coins though. In the question of where does a swimmer keep her balls, that'll be inside the cosy. Didn't have to get some funny looks when I got out of the water though. <laughs> now that I've managed to dress myself and get dried, uh, there's a few more things I've got to do before I can have an, another swim in this same kit. So looking at these, the footwear here, which are my little decathlon five or six quid things, um, there's quite a lot of mud and grass and bits and bobs in there so I need to make sure that's fully cleaned out before I get back into the water. Same thing with the swimmers, um, I'll, I'll be washing that thoroughly out and my goggles and hat um, also I'll be washing the towel off as well. Certainly don't want to be responsible for moving those microscopic uh, invasive species across waterways. Anyway onwards and upwards Go get another towel, another set of swimmers, uh, some more goggles, and let's, uh, let's go dipping, hopefully, in waterfalls.
hey boy. I must say, I highly recommend the Brecon Beacons, especially the waterfalls area of it, for a little swimming trip. So many dips, so many swims, so many possibilities, absolutely bloody brilliant. I hope and it's given you a little bit of food for thought regarding biosecurity and making sure you don't spread stuff between waterways. I hope you've enjoyed this week's video. If you have, give it a like and uh, drop me a comment, let me know what else you'd like to see. Also, hit that little circle at the top which has got my face on it and you'll be able to subscribe. It'd be great to have you along and I'll see you next time.